let us see power consumption or power rating of household appliances and electrical energy consumption let us see the tube light the tube light is one of the appliances in your home it has 36 watts to 40 watts now it is 12 watts also there tube light but led bulb has 5 watts to 15 watts fan 70 watts to 120 watts it will be there average you can consume it can consume power 70 watts refrigerator or fridge 200 watts it will consume power a refrigerator consumes a power 200 watts minimum maximum is 250 watts also there in ac consumes 1 kilowatt power that is 1000 watts a tv LED TV consumes 70 watts, whereas picture tube TV it will be 500 watts also will be there. But averagely we can write TV as 70 watts, AC as 1000 watts. If the refrigerator has 200 watts, fan 70 watts, 120 watts also fan is there. Tube light 15 watts to 36 watts, 40 watts also will be there in golden days. This is about TV fridge 70. Next grinder 400 watts it will be grinder. Washing machine 500 watts, geyser 1000 watts, 1 kilowatt hour, or heater, water heater you are using in your home, then it is a 1000 watts to 1500 watts, that is 1.5 kilowatt. That means uh, mostly heater will consume more power. Water heater, if you use in your home, heater consumes more power, that is 1000 watts to 1500 watts, that is 1.5 kilowatt to 1 kilowatt. Laptop may be 50 watts the laptop may consume power 50 watts like that whereas power can electrical equipment power how it they consume ceiling fans 220 per fan ceiling fan if it is a table fan it may be reduced to 150 watts usage time if it is 18 hours per day ceiling fan led bulbs uses 15 bulbs per bulb 15 watts is the per bulb then 12 hours if you use TV 250 watts, 8 hours if you use per day, then what is the electrical electrical energy consumption? That is how many units for your home consumed, you can write like that. What are the electrical appliances in your home and what is in watts usage time? If you write, then you can calculate electrical energy consumption, induction stove or electric cooker, induction stove or electric cooker, they may be consumed 1800 watts, 4.5 hours per day then tv if you use 250 watts for 8 hours per day then power consumption can each equipment per day you can calculate after that it is multiplied into 30 days then you will get then you will get uh, total electricity consumption that is you can get you can write it is ceiling fan 4 if you use 220 watts 18 18 hours then 880 into 18 that is 115.84 kilowatt hour the ceiling fans be LED bulb 6 hours if you use 12 bulbs 15 watts each 1 kilowatt or 1 unit per day TV if you use 8 hours 250 into 2 2 kilowatt hour 2 units it will consume next immersion heaters or uh, water heaters if you use 4.5 hours then 8 kilowatt hour totally electrical energy consumption 27.02 kilowatt hour if you add all this 27.02 electrical energy consumption for one month power consumed is into 30 days we have to do that is 27.02 into 30 if you do 810 units one unit means one kilowatt hour 810 units it will consume total electricity bill consume for your home is total power consumed in one month into cost of electrical unit one unit cost is may vary three rupees to five rupees according to the state if you consider our on and average 3.45 rupees then 810 units into 3.45 you will get 2796 rupees electricity bill you will get rupees it is not kwh it is rupees you will get 2796 kilowatt hour total units are 810 per month if the cost of electricity bill one unit cost is 3.45 rupees one unit means one kilowatt hour cost that is 2796.57 watts like that total electricity bill you can consume for 
one home. This is also calculation of electrical energy for premises, your premise house premises. Okay, simply what is a kilowatt hour? One unit is called one kilowatt hour. If you consume based on running how much time that electrical apparatus running in your home usage in your home that decides your electricity consumption if you not use the fixed charges may be there that is 100 rupees for your current bill electricity bill like that it will be calculated 